Today, we're going to walk through how commissions on services and items are calculated when you check out a client on Square Appointments. We'll also cover some simple steps you can take to make sure commissions are attributed to the right staff. So let's pretend we're a stylist here at this salon, Camille. And I just wrapped up with my client, Alicia, and now I want to check her out for the appointment. Double clicking on the appointment, we can see that Alicia has had a short haircut and full highlights. Both services here are attributed to me, but actually my colleague Elisa took care of the highlights for me since I had another client to get started with. To make sure Elisa gets properly commissioned, I can change the service provider by using the dropdown and hit save. My other colleague at the front desk also shared some info on a couple hair products and Alicia decided to buy them. I'll add them here to the appointment and then also make sure that my colleague, Carolyn, is attributed for the sale. Once I've properly set the staff attribution for each service and item, I can simply click Save and Take Payment, proceed with saving and not sending a notification, adding a tip to the appointment, and then taking payment. To verify that the commissions have been attributed correctly, I can scroll down to the bottom of this appointment and click through to view the transaction. Once this loads, I can scroll to the bottom of the transaction blade on the right to view earning details. Here you'll see the final amount of tip and commission allocated to each staff member. To look at the individual calculations, I can simply hover over the eye icon here in order to see them. Lastly, commissions and tips can also be viewed by navigating to reports and then team sales. Here you'll see the gross sales for the day, as well as any tips that are calculated off of that and commissions.